and you can stand right in the middle of, the, of the studio. You go in after them. Okay. Go! and shine it's a little pt time here we go all right early physical therapy this morning early do i toast my bobo bars you better believe it makes them taste oh so good there we go bobo bar time for papa easy for papa <laughs> just one sec Oh, there's uh, something else in there, too. Oh, those are the boys. Okay. <laughs> do I have to say it? Do, do, do I have to say it, you two family? Butter my bobo. Butter <laughs> my bobo. Uh-oh. There we go. Butter my bobo. Mm. Always heating up my coffee. It's a little ridiculous. It's a little ridiculous. We are off to physical therapy, and then massage therapy, and then the gym. Okay, there's the studio. We will be back to finish that later. There's some more items for the studio. Redesign those boxes. Oh, it's exciting. Oh, man. Yes, and we have running shoes. Those are empty, just so everyone else. Oh yeah, whenever I do PT, I always feel better afterward, not just for the knee, but everything else on the lower legs, on the legs, uh, it's, uh, gosh, and I try to film the new exercises that he adds, and that's what these sheets are that I'm trying to communicate with all of you in the videos, especially the prehab video from last week, because I'm learning every single time I go in there, just new movements, I don't want to say exercise, but movements in order to strengthen all of the muscles around the knee, above the knee. Um, I, th I think my favorite are still the, the lateral band and then the monster walks, uh, but the lateral band walks side to side with the uh, resistance band around my ankles. Today's a day off, no running. Yesterday I ran three miles, Monday I ran two miles, so Friday, tomorrow, just got the thumbs up in the uh, PT office, shout out to Ricky, to go for four miles tomorrow, okay? So what is that, tomorrow's Friday, I believe, yeah. So when you're watching this, I'll do four miles a day. Why do I swim? Because I don't want to swim. Okay, pretty chilly today. Cheers. Okay, since we are talking about innovation today, uh, I know there's a lot of running YouTube channels out there right now that are tuning in and I appreciate you tuning into my channel. And just so you know, I do subscribe to a lot of running YouTube channels. I just can't watch them all the time, but uh, I'm watching what, I'm seeing what you're doing and for innovation on YouTube, audio is always most important. Up your audio game and you will, it's amazing how much people appreciate good audio but second is always always lighting and so that's what i'm doing here in the studio i'm just trying to uh work with what i have to improve the 
uh, the lighting effects here in the studio. So anyway, just a little, little tip for all the running YouTubers out there is continue to innovate your audio and your lighting. It's, uh, it's absolutely, it's more important, frankly, than, uh, it's way more important than cameras or cameras or lenses or lens, like that a really, really expensive camera equipment is great uh, down the road. First and foremost, audio and lighting. Let there be light. Oh, yeah, baby, there it is. Oh, butter my bread. Let's see here. Oh, nice. Wow, interesting. Oh, wow. Wow. Okay, this is cool. All right, we're going to go get the family, come back in, then we're going to eat dinner, and then I'll wrap up, talk about innovation on YouTube and in running. This is pretty sweet. Oh, baby. Don't touch anything because nothing is secured to the wall yet, okay? So when you go in, you just have to, all right, so you can't, so just look, and you can stand right in the middle of the studio. You go in after them. Go! How's that? Now, we're not done yet. Right, we're not done yet. They haven't, she, our YouTube family hasn't seen it yet. I'm totally helping. Isn't this, isn't He's this totally cool? Helping He's totally helping. This is amazing. Isn't it cool? It's do you feel like you're transported? Boom, back to the future. It's, or, yeah, or into, into the, the future. future. Into the future. Oh, no remember, we go put it back. Go put it back. Wow. So, not too shabby. That is incredible. So, obviously, there's no shoes on in here yet. That is, a, that you is got, amazing. Okay. So, we're going to show you all the reveal after we eat dinner. All right, we got to go eat dinner. Woo! All right, here we go. What do you guys think? Yeah, yeah, you can help build it. Oh, precious. Hey, that's amazing. Let me hand you this guy real quick. So I'm going to stop the camera. Oh, my goodness. It's just, it's just mind-blowing from where the, sh the studio, literally my shed, used to be and to what uh, it's become, frankly, because of all of you coming back hitting that subscribe button and pushing me forward to innovate and to continue to try, to strive, to bring you as much value as possible here on YouTube. And that's what I'm trying to do with this little, you know, nothing crazy, but this little, and I'm looking at it right now, it's just, and, it, and we're not done, by the way. So I still have some pieces of uh, gear, or not gear, but some things to put up on the wall that I just, uh, I'm not gonna do it today, but the major, work is done and I'm still going to develop uh, better lighting in here just to make sure the lighting looks good uh, and yeah we're just going to tinker for a little bit for example the shelves that you're about to see are not attached to the wall yet because I might move them around a little bit any it's all about that innovation and tinkering and figuring out and I think that's why I coach myself and I love to tinker and just figure out what works and what does not work um, so innovation on YouTube and in running, all right? And the question of the day is coming up here in one second, but this knee injury, I have had to innovate, thanks to the physical therapist mostly, but I've had to innovate my training because of this knee injury. This is the first knee injury that I've had since high school, 15 years ago, basically, when I had IT band issues. And so all the hip exercises, all the stuff you saw earlier today, and then some, is teaching me to innovate my training and to adapt to the situations that are coming up and unfortunately in this case a kind of you know negative situation that I'm trying to turn into a positive with the PT work and with frankly switching gyms like I mentioned earlier in order to seek out the equipment and the resources that are in my backyard um, to take care of the body even better so again so we can strive to hit 2020 goals that we've already talked about here on the channel in uh the, in this month so all right enough said question of the day um on innovation enough said on innovation i love i love innovating and okay one last point i'm sorry youtubers out there running youtubers th this channel has gone from you know basically a thousand subscribers to what are we at like fifty five thousand a thousand to fifty five thousand in um in basically 15 months okay why i think because of a little bit of innovation where i'm trying new things that other running YouTubers are not doing. So I would just encourage you, if you are a running YouTuber, if you put yourself in that category, um, which frankly, that's a tip of the day for the running YouTubers, niche down, 
but strive to innovate and do stuff different from what I'm doing, from what other running you do something totally new, totally different. And that's what I'm trying to do here in the studio. Okay, question of the day. How are you innovating your running and your training in 2020? All right, and we've, this kind of connects to like, uh, goals and you know not yeah goals new year's resolutions to a certain extent but like innovation that is really concrete okay so that's the question of the day i love you all all right are you ready for the big reveal oh man so i mean i gotta switch the camera hold on let me let me get let me move the camera okay here we go a little countdown three two one and welcome to the new studio there it is oh my goodness everybody it's just crazy. Like I used to have my lawnmower in here, my weed eater, my saws. I still have some saws in here, but here's the shelving. Here's the backdrop. Of course, a little neon green lighting to uh, get a little get a little pizzazz going in here. So, and then here's that background. Oh, so here's the deal. I'm not done. This shelf. Look at that. It's still. You know, I haven't attached anything to the wall yet. I'm still gonna work on uh, the configuration that I really, really want. But I'll just show you. Like, what's the idea here? is that I'll be able to do something like that, something like that. Let me grab another one. And uh, just to uh, be able to access shoes very easily here in the studio. And like, for example, this shelf probably, it's probably not gonna stay right here. Um, also, I'll just show you, like this is gonna be another shelf right there that attaches to the wall right there. Oh my goodness. So we are not done. Thank you for your patience. Here's the redesigned. The goal of the redesign was to freshen up the studio, uh, make it a little more crisp. And again, it's a work in progress, but I wanted to show you at least a little bit of this. Oh, that looks pretty sweet right there. I haven't even really stepped back and oh yeah. So also I'm gonna attach, uh, and again, you know, it's, oh yeah, video production. What, what did I say earlier? It's all about lighting. I'm gonna attach little lights right here to shine down on the shoes, okay? so. You know, it's all about lighting and it just takes time to get it done. So thank you for being here. Thank you for watching. Thanks for inspiring me to innovate here in the studio. You guys are the best doing this for you. Hoping to bring you as much value as possible. All right, everyone, we're going to toss it back on the right to, who knows, an old studio vlog when the studio was not the studio, when it was just a shed, basically. So that'll be on the right. And then on the left, we'll toss it back to... Um, you know, we'll toss it back to yesterday's first impression of the Nike React Infinity Run Flying It. All right, there you have it, everyone. See beauty, work hard, and love each other. See you tomorrow.